Either you will love me wholly or you won't. If you do, there is always a risk of I becoming me. The world will start becoming couples and you will look back to the days of your own beer and your own playlist. If it is not, you will continue to be reckless. But there will be someone else, I warn. There will be battles where you will either win or lose. And much will intrigue you. And just as much will sadden you. But consequences, who knows? My loving you wholly is not a promise. This is just a word. This poem had no preamble or declaration. This poem promises nothing and delivers even less. It has no expectation for disappointment. Eliminate anything you don't already know. I imagine being born and then I am alive. I imagine each day of my life. I imagine it all happened when I all I really do is imagine. Each night, famous American bridges, calm red cantilevered Americans, fill my wet dreams with foamy oceans. Five, an, an avid photographer, the king stopped to take photos of statues of his parents. Six. What time did you set that false alarm? Seven. She kneels in the darkness, waiting for me. I'm looking for something she has lost. She has wrapped it up and put it away. She is miles away, meters away, here and away. Are the same now, now we are the same. Why you suckle? Let me tell you a story of a great dynasty that stretched from the wet-soaked plains of the Western Ghats to the lands of Tamil Nadu, where language roamed unchained. Sala wandered through a forest, feet moved to the echo of insects. The wind flapped his robes. He tripped over the tail of a lion and looked down into the mandibles of death, gated with sharp canines, and heard Hoi Sala and struck his sword, steel bulldozing through the mane, sinewy neck, and a yelp that stupefied the forest into silence. Don't worry, baby. Continue to nibble. After this incident, he built an empire. Three sucks later, you turn to me, wrestle me down, cradle my neck, leg like a lioness holding on to a running wildebeest. There was a moan, a start of an empire. Any safety I find is temporary. Any refuge is not permanent. But my teacher would say, all things are impermanent and change. I hope that our situation will change. Some days I cannot bear another moment of being under siege. For the rest of it, you have to read the novel. <laughs>